Today is going to be a wild day. We are officially packing up and closing down the shop. So it's going to be exciting today. Come along for the ride. There's a peel, Alex, packing up the shop. Woo! Feels so good. Positivity. <laughs> We're gonna try and get all of this broken down, moved over and set up by the end of the week. Today is Wednesday, so we'll see how it goes. Luckily, we have our man Kevin, who we have not introduced to the YouTube community yet. K-Dog, as I like to call him. I don't really call him that that often. Okay, I kind of do call him that that often. He has worked in the industry for four years. He's worked for three other van conversion companies. We were lucky enough to steal him locally. Um, awesome guy, tons of experience. He's also funny. And he's made us institute tie-dye fry dye, which is pretty fun. <laughs> there he is, meet Kevin. He's sweeping up the back. This has been the embarrassing reality of working at home. <laughs> Isn't that right, Alex? This is Woo! the shop area extension storage facility for all the van build parts. And you know. Got it. Then we've got Vance's sweet little ride there. So, all this is getting moved today. How are you feeling about it? Oh, so excited. So dang exciting. Can't wait. Proud of us. There he goes. Woo! He's busy. But oh, yes, our garage will finally be emptied out enough that I'll probably be able to pull my car in again, which will be nice. So, excited to get all this shop stuff out of the garage. Let's go see what Sarah's doing. Oh wow, it's looking good in here. Good, you ready for some tea? Oh, <laughs> hello, are you with mic on? Uh-huh. <laughs> That's good. I'm just setting up shop in here. Wow. Are we going into the interior design business? Maybe. Looks great. I'm gonna make the shop look so good that you're gonna wanna remodel our house. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> okay. How are you feeling about it all? Good, I'm tired. It's been a long day. How's it been? Really long making day. some progress. Yeah, ooh, I like that chair here. Out into the loud shop. It doesn't even feel like we're making a dent in here. But this is pretty much all of it. We need to move that van in. Here we go, van's coming in. Number one. Number two. How does it feel? Get a couple vans in here. It doesn't seem all that big anymore, does it? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Sarah's getting the champagne ready to go. Yeah, popping bottles. So we talked about Kevin a little bit, but I'm not sure we actually really put Kevin on camera. Howdy, everybody. Can't, can't have you backlit, though. Hold oh. on. This is K Dog, <laughs> the Kevster. Howdy. It's Friday, so he's got his tie-dye on. Tie-dye Friday! Exactly. Here's to the new shop, many van builds that are gonna be built. Should I actually pop it? Nah. Yeah, you should. No, you shouldn't. <laughs> oh, yeah, well don't spill, but. Let's see if I can get Ready? it. Ready? You do it. These ones are hard, okay, I got it. Woo! Woo! That's a good time. go. <laughs> A little cups. slow to the uh, <laughs> finale there. Sorry. We're done. The shop is pretty much set up. I think we got it all done in Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Three days. That means on Monday I got to finish this van. So stay right. tuned for that van tour, our own personal van tour. And yeah, thanks guys for watching. Cheers, guys. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> Where? Where are you going? I'm sad. I got it. <laughs> Can you what? say hi to everybody? Yeah. Oh, you want to gonna... touch it? No, 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 no. <laughs> well, decided to bring the boys no, by. No, okay, we won't get any pictures. It's okay. Vance is not a huge fan of the camera, as you can tell. So we are mostly moved in. We will do a full tour once we're officially settled and you know, 
have the beautiful pictures on the wall and all that stuff. But how does it feel? So good. To be really mostly. Close. Even stocking the little mini fridge. Yeah, we're getting a real fridge, but it doesn't come. Everything's back ordered. We're gonna get a big table for in there. I think it comes today. So all in all, it was a great move last week. We we're so excited to be in the new space. And now it's time to finish our client's van. Time to get back to work. <laughs> yeah. Well, hey, moving is work, okay? Get back to the work to bring some money in. Okay, sitting on the floor, even though I've got chairs behind me because we don't have a table, so I have nowhere to prop up the camera. I just wanted to oh, sit down and talk for a minute. It has been quite a journey to get here. The shop has been in the works for almost eight months. We had to wait for it to be built, which was actually really nice because we got to then, you know, tweak the floor plan and, you know, add our own flooring and all the little upgrades that we wanted. But the commercial space, just real estate in general here in Boise, Idaho is crazy right now. So there's really nothing available unless it's being built right now. <laughs> um, so it was a really fun process to come by and see the shop being built and I can't believe we're actually here. It has been such a journey to get here. It's been a wild ride for the last couple of years. Um, since we moved here two and a half years ago, we built 10 vans in our small shop and now it's just empty. It's very surreal. We're really excited about having a real commercial space and what that means for our business, how we get to expand. We just hired someone a few months ago, Kevin, who you met in this video, and then we just hired somebody else new this week, hopefully also hiring someone to help on the content side so that we can actually start putting out more videos. Now, with all that said, I did want to talk about us not really posting all that much on YouTube or Instagram or social media in general for the last couple years. For us, we really enjoy living life in real life and not always whipping out the camera. It doesn't feel authentic to always be filming what's going on in real life because as soon as the camera comes out, whether or not it's real or not, the camera is there. So there's always like putting on a bit of a show. And I think that YouTube is a great, amazing space and community, but at the same time, a lot of people just get sucked into consuming content all the time. You guys know we are big on creating more, consuming less, and we really encourage you all to do that. So we, we personally don't feel great putting out videos and, and asking you guys to come back weekly to watch our videos because that means you're not out there creating awesome stuff in your life. You're, you're sitting and consuming a video and we really wanna encourage people to create epic stuff in their own life. Go do your own DIY man build, go on a hike with your family, whatever it is, getting off these bones and living in the moment. Um, so it's a really big reason why we have not been putting out that much content for the last couple of years. We've really been enjoying our time with our kids while they're little. That's really what's most important. And we don't feel authentic to whip out the camera and film our kids in our lives all the time. So with that said, I thank you for being here, for watching our content. Um, we are excited. Oh, my legs are falling asleep. We are excited to start putting out a little bit more content um, and sharing some of the behind the scenes. So if you have any suggestions on things you guys want filmed coming up, things you want to see, topics you want to see us talk about, let us know. But yeah, I just want to sit down, do a little catch up. It's been a wild couple of years. We're excited to be where we're at um, and excited to share a little bit more with you guys. We definitely feel ready. We were in um, the newborn craziness and two under two for a while. So we were definitely tired, really tired. Anyways, I am big on get out there, create awesome stuff, stop watching what everybody else is doing. I encourage you to take a look at who you follow, the content you're watching online, and does it inspire you? Does it make your life better? Does it lift you up? Or is it something that makes you feel bad about your life? And if it is, time to reevaluate, maybe stop following that person for a while and focus on getting out in real life and doing awesome stuff. So. Oh, rant over. I did want to thank today's sponsor, Squarespace. If you don't know this already, 
you haven't watched any of our other videos, we absolutely love Squarespace. Squarespace is an all-in-one platform. You can even build an e-commerce shop right into your website without hiring any expensive web designers or tech people to run it for you. It's so intuitive to go in, add your own products, set up your shop, even say if it's a physical product or it's a digital product, and from there, it's just really easy to add your own products, add taxes if you need to, and it's all integrated into Squarespace's platform without doing anything extra on the back end. So if you're ready to check out Squarespace, head to squarespace.com for a free two-week trial, and when you're ready to launch, head to squarespace.com forward slash 40 hours for 10% off your purchase of a website or domain. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. It's craziness around here. I'm working on wrapping up this video edit and the office is kind of getting settled. And I'll give you a little sneak peek of our van and our client's van. I'm gonna finish the van. Gonna try to. First we gotta figure out where all of our tools are. It's the problem with moving into a 